love never fails, but whether there be prophecies, they shall fail. Whether there be tongues, they shall cease. Whether there be knowledge, it shall vanish away. For we know in part, and we prophesy in part. But when that which is perfect is come, then that which is in part shall be done away. When I was a child, I spake as a child. I understood as a child. I thought as a child. But when I became a man, I put away childish things. For now we see through a glass dimly, or darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I know, even as I am known. And now abideth faith, hope, charity, but these three, but the greatest of these is charity. 1 Corinthians 13, 8-13 Love will continue on forever. One day there will be no need for prophecy, languages, and knowledge, especially supernatural expressions of these. The end of these things will come when, when I am known, when I know, even as I am known. One day faith will not be needed, because we will see all that is unseen, and we will no longer hope, because that which we earnestly desire will be fulfilled and will manifest in us and around us. Romans 8:25. We did not know as we are known after the book of Revelation was finished, after the apostles and their associates died, or even when the scriptures were canonized, we will know as we are known when we are perfected in his glory. Until then, prophecy, languages, and knowledge are needed so we can at least see dimly. Love is a principal thing. Even though I may know huge passages of scripture with degrees to prove it, be able to speak 40 languages and dialects, understand human behavior enough to figure everyone out, know all that there is to know about the secular world, totally up to date with all matters of human life, master every field of knowledge, whether music or sports or medicine or whatever, be so in touch with the Spirit of God that he's breathing in my ear, my prayers are so powerful it's almost as if I barely speak the word and God answers me like that to move mountains or I spend six hours a day in prayer, write a check to break my bank account and feed the poor, nail myself to a cross and set myself on fire for the name of Jesus. If I have seen God do great and marvelous, even miraculous things, if I have all these things and I don't have love, it's useless. Faith, the foundation of our spiritual life, trust in God's word and what empowers prayer, the earnest expectation that God will answer, that his promises are true, and that what is unseen is more of a reality than what is seen, even the evidence of these things to be true. Hope, the joy of our hearts expecting Christ to return, the strength of our souls to see his promises fulfilled, and the glory that awaits us in, as Christians in heaven, the confident assurance that God is working good in the midst of tragedy, and the light that guides us to him. Love. The greatest of these three is love. Can I exist without God's love? In a sense, maybe. Can I be effective without it? Then again, maybe I can't really live at all apart from it. Because his love breathes life into me again and allows me to forgive. Release bitterness. Cover others' faults. Find hope in trying circumstances. Love when others hurt. Change, grow, and live. As I find my own heart nailed to the cross of Christ and it bleeds from the pain of sin in this world, he resurrects me and gives me a totally new heart that is, in fact, his own. Many waters cannot quench love, neither can the floods drown it. If a man would give all the substance of his house for love, it would utterly be condemned. 
Song of Songs 8-7. I still find these verses striking, primarily because of the power of love. It cannot be put out. It cannot be extinguished or drowned. No matter how fierce of a war that rages against it, love always wins. Always. No matter how many demons, how many armies of men, or wars that rage, or nuclear weapons there are, no matter how many heretical views, no matter how many offenses and wounds and separations, love will always win because love is not afraid of anything or anyone. Love cannot be stopped 